If you have multiple screens, you can synchronize their content so that their media changes at the same time, whether they are all displaying the same content or individual content. All the screens have to be connected to the same local network and must have a consistent connection to keep them in sync. First, you must activate the sync function on your screens. To do this, begin by going to your first screen and accessing the main menu by pressing stop. Then once you are back at the blue home screen, press setup. Next, press the right directional button to access the right side menu, then press down until you reach sync settings. Then press play to select. This setting will likely be in the off position. Turn it on by pressing play. You will then see some other settings appear. On the first screen, set the sync role to host, and on all the other screens, set the sync role to slave. On both the host and the slave screens, set the sync method to network. Once you have finished, go up to and select the back button. Then press the left directional button to access the left side menu and navigate to and select exit. Finally, press play to start playing your screen's content. If you want all of your screens to play the same content at the same time, all you have to do is publish the same playlist to all of your screens. Once the screen downloads all the media files, they will automatically synchronize their content. If you want all of your screens to play different content at the same time, you just need to ensure that each of the media files are ordered correctly and the images are given the same duration time and transition effect. In this simple example, two different videos that both have a duration of 10 seconds are ordered to play first. Then, two different images are both set to display for 10 seconds each on both playlists. Setting your separate playlists up like this will ensure that when they are published, everything stays in sync. Synchronising the content on your screens really is that simple.